Um, part two, I'm gonna wrap it up. Um, so two out of three, two out of four. I need to drink <laughs> and not just water. Two out of four of those weekends, I've been working all weekend. You know, I was down in Austin, and then before that, I was at the Arnold all weekend working. And then this past weekend, you know, to come home, get home at six or seven o'clock at night on a Friday, and then go to sleep and wake up, and I'm babysitting. And for me, see, those of you that have kids, it's different. When you're used to having kids all the time, you make accommodations in your life. And But yet, when I'm babysitting my nieces, you know, that's one of the few times that I get one-on-one -on -one time with them. So I don't want to give that up and say, go sit and watch TV. Um, I'm gonna work out or go sit and watch TV. I'm gonna blog or you know read my blog So, you know a lot of the stuff that I do on the weekends I didn't get to do which is fine, but it's just you know I have to take that into consideration. So that was my weekend. That's kind of why I was out of pocket for a little bit so um, I'm actually in town all week and I'm really gonna be looking and doing kind of a wrap-up Kelly you so inspire me with the way you track everything and you evaluate things by quarters. I mean, that's what I do in my work, right? I'm evaluated quarter by quarter, month by month um, by my bosses. So, you know, why not do it in my personal life? It's a good way to keep yourself on track and not just kind of like flow and let the, let the year flow. And then it's six months into it and you're like, oh, I guess I never really did start doing that extra cardio. Oh, I guess I didn't really start making sure I'm below 1500 calories every day. You know, if you just think you wing it, it's not gonna happen. Fail to plan, plan to fail. Always true with this one, I'll tell you that much. Um, I also am gonna share with you, I met an amazing woman um, who has started her own, like, kind of fan page on Facebook. Um, she decided she wanted to lose 150 pounds, and so I believe her Facebook fan page is 150 pounds or bust, but she's blogging and taking video of her, she's already lost 40 pounds, if I'm correct. I might, it might be 30 um, in her first two months, um, but she wants to lose 150 pounds, and I met her. What an amazing person. So I'm going to share that with you and hopefully maybe do some kind of like co-interview. And um, I should have done that when I was out there, but I didn't bring my camcorder. I digress. So anyway, um, that was cool. I'm in town all week, so I'm going to have a kick butt uh, week. I'm going to start off the second quarter, um, taking everything I've learned in the first quarter, and amping it up to notches unknown, okay? Because this second quarter, we all know, it's the second quarter before real summer weather, okay? I'm not going into this summer and putting my shorts on and have my shorts tight, uh-uh, okay? Here's one thing that's funny, though. I'm very pleased with my butt right now. My butt is very happy. <laughs> I'm telling you, the guy, <sighs> I really have not had a lot of caffeine today. I think that's what my issue is. Um, for me, I'm losing weight from, you know, you can see it's it's like it's happening from my, the top down and from the bottom up. And the last place it's happening is this, it's like I told you, that little strip of extra fat that I have in an area that I've never had it, which is like lower abs, lower hips, right above my butt. That's where it is. And let me tell you, it's the most stubborn little area. But here's the thing. Number one, it is getting less every day. I put on my workout clothes and I'm not gonna lie, this is exactly what happened. I put my workout clothes on and I'm looking at that little area, I'm like, oh, damn. And I'm like, okay, because every time I get dressed, because I wanna track, I told you, I take my mirror and I look at like the rear view, okay? And I was like, Kelly, you're probably not gonna like what you see, but you know, you're getting better every day, so don't get pissed off. So I went like this, it looked so much better than I even thought, okay? So I'm like, you're getting there, you're getting there, okay? We've gotta keep encouraging ourselves. Amy, even though I know you're heading to the Bahamas or someplace right now, I'm listening to you. And I am still drinking soda. <laughs> Just not right now. So, that's it. I don't like doing my workouts at night, but I'm, here I go again with the funny hair. <sighs> Just feel like doing that again. Anyway, my shoulders are coming along nicely. And the nice thing about shoulders and arms, people, is the more that you lose weight, the more fat that you lose in your body, the more your arms just start to pop. It's awesome. Um, so workout's good. I'm just really ready to take it up another notch. Me and Sherry are just totally encouraging each other and kicking butt because we're like, that's it. I've got my bikini hanging in my refrigerator. The, the bikini bottoms are hanging in my refrigerator. So when I open that fridge, I see my bikini bottoms and my bikini top is hanging on my, um, on my pantry there. So every time I want to open something up, I'm looking at that and I'm like, okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah. 
and then no. So then I just walk away. So that's all there is to it. Um, I'm gonna do a wrap up of my first quarter and what my plans are for this quarter and I'm ready. Um, I think I know, like looking back at the first quarter, I can now go, okay, you know, here's what I did well, you know, and I'm tracking it on my calendar, right? And I'm able to look back and see what I did right. Um, but that's when you can look at it and go, okay, here's everything I did and here's what was good about it and here's the results, okay? And that's when you have to look at things, people. And it's that old adage of, you know, to get what you've never had, you've got to do what you've never done. So if you look at one, two, three, and realize what it equals, and it's not, you know, what it equals is not what you wanted, okay? I haven't lost the, the, the total amount of fat that I want. I've lost some. I'm gonna write down exactly what I expect to lose and the inches that I wanna lose because I don't weigh myself. Some of you guys weigh yourselves. I measure myself. I'm gonna write down the inches that I wanna lose in the next three months and I'm going to do it, period. Um, because I've kicked butt for the first um, three months. But you know what? I don't wanna to get to the end of the next three months and go, well, I did well. I'm still not there. I mean, I don't want to just keep spinning my wheels. I'm trying to get somewhere, okay? And I'm on my way there. I need to get to that shore and get there so that I can say I've done it. And then it's time to just, you know, build a hut on the shore and then maybe hire a cabana boy and then maybe relax for a little bit and enjoy some mojitos. Can you see where my mind is right now? Thinking about vacation. So, on that note, I have to go. I have to work out. I still have to go grocery shopping. I'm so looking forward to really taking two days off and I'm gonna do it. I'm not gonna work. I'm gonna take that time for myself. I'm going to enjoy it and maybe actually have a weekend um, where I'm not running around like a chicken with my head cut off. I love my life and I love my work, um, but sometimes I just, I need a break and I have to make myself take a break because I'm kind of one of those people that just doesn't take a break. And I still haven't gotten my new, what's the word I'm looking for? I need an assistant here just to prompt me on this stuff. Camcorder, tripod. So, and Sarah, I promise you I'm gonna be going and buying a tripod and a new tripod and a new webcam because she wants to Skype with me. <laughs> anyway, I gotta go. You guys are awesome. I've missed you, please forgive me. I try to really not go that long, but this has just kind of been extenuating circumstances. Um, a trip plus babysitting. <sighs> Somebody find me some non Racerback tank tops for working out. Someone. I think I'm gonna get a massage tonight. Maybe, I gotta call Renee. Anyway, I'm just rambling and you guys are used to it. So we'll talk tomorrow. I'm sorry about two blogs. Oh my God, and it's gonna be 15 minutes total. So I'm so sorry about your day, but um, that's it. You guys have a great day and we'll talk tomorrow. You're gonna get me all week. It's gonna be like so much. You're gonna be like, wow, that's too much. Okay, so we'll talk later. Bye bye <laughs>